in Romans 4, 20, 21. I thought about you, Pastor Bill, for he staggered not at the promises of God, but through unbelief, but was strong in faith, being fully persuaded that what he had promised, he was able also to perform it. In 1 Corinthians 15, 57, but thanks be unto God, which giveth us the victory through our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Somebody shout, victory. Ephesians 3 and 20, now unto him that is able. Somebody shout, he's able. I'll tell you what he's able to do. He's able to do exceeding and abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that worketh in us. In Philippians 4, 13, I can do all things through Christ which strengtheneth me. In Philippians 4, 19, but my God shall supply all of your needs. Now, he didn't say according to who was in the White House. He didn't say according to your banker. He didn't even say according to your lawyer, your accountant, your doctor, or your employer. But according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. I came all the way from Dallas, Texas to tell you tonight that not only does he own the cattle on a thousand hills, but he owns the thousand hills that the cattle are standing on. He owns the lakes that they drink out of. He owns the grass that they eat off of. He owns the barns that they eat out of. I'm telling you, he owns it all. He's able. 